Jingle bells ringing in my ear. Good morning. Oh, this is a cute angle. Ugh. Hey guys, welcome to the vlog. Welcome to another day of Vlogmas. I am so tired this morning. I don't know what happened last night. I know I went to bed really late, but I like slept the same time that I usually do. Y'all ever like have those nights where you sleep so hard that it's like you wake up more tired? I'm just like, what day is it? What time is it? I know what year it is. I have this leftover coffee from Dunkin' yesterday because I always order their coffees. Their coffees are so sweet. Like they are really, really sweet. Like I usually get a really big one, but I got a medium this time and this is still huge. But anyways, I didn't finish it because it was so sweet yesterday. So I'm like, maybe all the, <laughs> maybe all the sugar will wake me up. I don't know. Uh, what do we got to do today? Today I need to go to the grocery store. Which I'll also probably clean the never ending dirty kitchen. Uh, yeah, I need to go to the grocery store and get stuff. We don't really have a whole lot of stuff in the house because last week we only really bought for Thanksgiving and I think we've reached the end of our Thanksgiving leftovers. I ate the last of them last night. So we need more food in the house. Also, it's like really cold outside. It's really sunny, but it's really uh, cold outside. So I'm thinking of meals that I can make in the crock pot that are like warm because Dagan has to be on the cold a lot this week, I think. So I just wanted to come home to yummy warm meals. I'll show you guys what I end up getting when I get home. Um, but yeah, I'm gonna make some breakfast though. I'm really hungry and I don't have any food for breakfast. And the Cheerios come in clutch. hate sneezing. I just hate it. Ugh, why do we have to sneeze? You guys, the flowers are still going strong. These are seriously so pretty. I, every morning I'll come down here and just be like, I love smelling flowers. I just love flowers. They just make me happy. I have the best husband, I swear. <laughs> All right, I'm gonna finish eating, drink some more coffee, probably watch some YouTube and then head to the grocery store. I uh, literally spent like 30 seconds just talking to the camera before I realized that it wasn't recording. All right, take two. Okay, so I just got back from the grocery store. I'm gonna show you guys what I got. Basically, I got a bunch of stuff to make warm, savory soup, crock pot meals because it's gonna be cold this week. It does not look cold outside because it is clear blue skies and sunny, which is beautiful. But it is cold. For Texas, it's cold. Let me show you guys what I got. I got Avocado oil, I was just running low on that. And that's the main oil that we cook with, so avocado oil. I got some more crackers. I love doing the cream cheese and not, not everything but the bagel, <laughs> everything but the bagel seasoning. So I got this and I got some um, wheat thins too, for those little crackers. Two things of beef broth, because I'm gonna make some beef stew probably tomorrow night because I want the beef to slow cook all day. It's a little late now. So tomorrow I'm going to be making beef stew. Ooh, maybe I'll show you guys how I make that. I've never made it before. So this will be new. Cheese puffs, Dagan's current favorite. I got some more eggs. These are just extra large basic eggs. I'm literally just going through the grocery bag. So there is no like order or rhyme or reason for what I'm showing you. I'm just showing you what I grab next. I got two serrano peppers. This is for the taco soup, which I think I'm going to, or tortilla soup, however you guys call it, which I think I'm going to make tonight. So I'm gonna use a little bit of serrano pepper, a little bit of garlic. I have a red onion. I'm not putting this in the soup, but I like to sometimes have an onion. Dagan 
hates onions. Like it is like like World War Three if there is onions in something. He like he thinks that he has a condition where he can't eat onions and they make him physically sick. I don't know if that's a real thing. He's not allergic. He just cannot stand onions. So sometimes I will get an onion for myself if I want to eat it on something but we do not cook with onions. We cook with onion powder occasionally, but other than that, I'm not allowed to cook with onions in this house. I know, it's a tragedy. Tragedy, tra tra travesty. Next, a cucumber. I got some zucchini, cause we just like eating zucchini with meat and a bunch of avocados. This household always has avocados. And then I got some more tomato because I'm gonna do a chicken and caprese salad. Dagan loves caprese salad. So I'm gonna make him some of that. So I got a bunch of tomatoes and then I just got a couple gala apples to eat with some cheese. That's like a healthy snack that I like to do every once in a while. I will do sliced apple and cheese and then sometimes some like peanut butter or almond butter. So next moving on to the meat, I got a bunch of stew meat for tomorrow and I got a bunch of chicken. Uh, we will just generally grill this or throw it in the oven. I will also take two of these chicken breasts and generally I will boil them and then shred them for the tortilla soup. Next in this bag, I, I'm not gonna go through one by one by one of everything. So I'll just tell you, I got a bunch of cans of beans and everything for the tortilla soup. I'm also gonna make chili. So for tortilla soup, I put canned corn, black beans, and pinto beans. And then I do petite diced tomatoes. Usually I'll do like fire roasted tomatoes or diced tomatoes with the little um, jalapenos in them, just the canned kind. And then for my chili, I use petite diced regular tomatoes as well as Great Northern white beans and kidney beans. This is all that's in here. Oh, and I got two cans of tomato paste for the beef stew. So for frozen, I got some hash browns because Dagan loves to have hash browns and eggs for breakfast when he doesn't have to work. And then I just got a bag of steak fries in case we make burgers, because oftentimes it's just kind of like an easy meal that we will um, make on the grill if we're just craving something simple. Alrighty, so the next item I got was Greek vanilla yogurt. I had originally bought yogurt last time at my grocery haul for me. Dagan ended up eating it and he loved it, so I figured I'd get him some more. And then I got the Kerrygold Pure Irish Butter. This is pretty much the only butter that I buy now. I know it's super bougie and expensive, but I like it. It's good. Cottage cheese and whipped cream cheese, only whipped. Y'all know the deal, only whipped. I got more pepper. I was out of pepper after Thanksgiving and I got some more uh, rice vinegar. I either will do this on like a cucumber salad or I oftentimes will make like an avocado roll or a cucumber roll for dinner if I don't feel like making anything else or we don't really have much in the house. And so I like to always have rice vinegar in my fridge that I can flavor the rice. Next, I just got a pack of basil for when I do our uh, caprese salad. And then I got a small thing of Worcestershire, Worcestershire. Worcestershire sauce, Worcestershire sauce for the beef stew. Orange juice, I really don't ever buy a lot of orange juice because I feel like it has a lot of sugar in it, but sometimes in the morning, just like a fresh thing of orange juice just sounds really good. More oat milk for coffee. I just get the oat, yeah, from Silk. And that's just the plain one. I don't do like the vanilla one or anything because I use it for coffee generally. And so I'll do like my oat milk, oat, <laughs> my oat milk vanilla creamer. Mushrooms, I don't really have a purpose for these mushrooms, but I like to just have them in our fridge in case I like to toss them in something. And then I got a huge bag of just golden yellow potatoes. I have a bunch of carrots in our fridge already that are left over from Thanksgiving, so I'm just gonna toss those in the stew as well, but I just needed some more potatoes. So I got Dagan some lunch meat. I generally will get him turkey and ham. He really likes the pepper turkey, and this is just the mesquite smoked ham, and he will generally make a sandwich when he comes home for lunch. Lean ground turkey, this will be for our chili that we make. And then I got a ball of mozzarella. This is just for the crazy salad, obviously. I got some bacon out of all the bacons that I try. This is my favorite. It's nothing fancy. It's not necessarily the best, but it's just good old bacon. As well as this grass fed ground beef. I really like when we were stationed in Hawaii, we found ground beef. It was like packaged like this and it was grass fed and it was local from the big island. And it was the best ground beef ever. And I've yet to find, hold on, sorry. Got a hair that came down my shirt. Anyways, I've yet to find a ground beef that tastes as good. This is pretty good. I mean, for what we got, but man, that ground beef was good. It was just really fresh because it was so like nearby. So it was good stuff. Okay, these are our little, uh, 
shoe bag. These are our little uh, indulgers, the Little Debbie Christmas trees. We don't get the Little Debbie stuff year round. It's just during the holidays when they have like the special ones, like the Christmas trees or like the brownie pumpkins or when they do the little heart pumpkin or not the heart pumpkins, when they do the um, heart brownies for Valentine's Day. I usually get them when they're like seasonal. I got some hamburger buns for if we do hamburgers as well as some fresh sourdough from the bakery. This is my favorite bread to get. And then lastly, I got some heat barbecue chips as well as these salt and vinegar chips. I haven't tried this brand from HEB yet. I usually get the Cape Cod kind, so I'm gonna try this and see if I like these ones. And that is pretty much all of the groceries that I got. I also got some sparkling water. Dagan loves sparkling water. And then I just got a case of Coke Zero because we just like to have that in the house. Pretty much that is everything that I got. And so I got to put this all away, but yeah, I'm just gonna make a bunch of savory, like yummy, warm meals this week. And I'm actually really excited to cook. I've been in kind of like, I get in like a funk lately. I don't know if it's just this year, but I feel like I've kind of been in a funk with not wanting to cook and so I don't know. I'm just excited to make something. Okay, so I'm filming on my phone because my camera literally just died as I was talking, but I changed. I'm just sitting in my beauty room at my desk and I have a little bit of a snack. I just have some apple cheese and peanut butter, some water, cause I am trying to drink more. My camera just turned back on, that was weird. Hello? Anyways, I'm trying to drink more water lately because I'm just trying to stay more hydrated. So yeah, I'm going to edit a little bit on some videos that I'm gonna put up for Vlogmas and then I'll probably check back in with you guys when I make dinner tonight. Good morning. Also, good morning to my little friend that decided to show up on my chin uh, yesterday. Y'all, I just wanted to uh, come on here and say that I, I messed up. I messed up badly. You see, yesterday, I, mm, I can't remember if I said that I was going to uh, finish vlogging yesterday and show you guys what I made for dinner. And then I'll probably check back in with you guys when I make dinner tonight. I can't remember if I said that or not, but after I edited my video, I completely blacked out and just like never picked up the camera again. And it was like 9 p.m. before I realized so here we are this morning to say this is probably gonna be the worst vlog ever, but I am going to make some breakfast because I am starving and get on with my day. Okay, so I'm gonna make eggs and I found this recipe off a gal that I follow on Instagram. So to start things off, you just wanna put a bunch of butter on the bottom of the pan and make sure it's spread all the way around. Okay, so next you're gonna wanna take some Parmesan and basically sprinkle it all over the pan and make like a layer of cheese. So cheese is in there, it is melting. So now I'm going to crack two eggs on top of the cheese. So the eggs are cracked on top of the cheese. They're starting to cook through. So basically you just wanna lightly cook them all the way through. So I'll let them cook for a little bit and then I'll put a pan on top to kind of like get the, the top of the egg cooked. So yeah. You guys will see when it's done. So my heater just turned on, so sorry if there's some background noise, but these are how the eggs are gonna live. So now I'm just gonna put a little bit of pepper, some garlic powder, and a little bit of smoked paprika. Alrighty, would you guys like to see all things heavenly? Ugh. So good. All right, you guys, I'm gonna end the vlog right here. I hope you guys enjoyed hanging out with me for for what I remembered to film. I hope y'all enjoyed that. And yeah, I'm gonna start doing um, some more like festive stuff though coming up. I wanna like bake Christmas cookies. I told Dagan we should make a gingerbread house. I definitely wanna go see Christmas lights. Stay tuned for that. That will be in the upcoming month of vlogs. And yeah, don't forget to subscribe and I will see y'all in the next one.